So I don't know if you see, but that is the signboard I saw that attracted me. I want to check out the place and find out what they do there. Don't laugh. I mean, it's a massage and I know the massage people, but girl is going to gossip. Yes, I'm going to bring you gist. <laughs> Guys, I'm confused though. I don't know if it's on the first floor or it's downstairs. But we are gonna do this anyway. So, <laughs> Jung Tai An Moa is the name of the place. An Moa means massage. So, Huang Yimi, Lai Dao, Jung Tai An Moa. Welcome to Seti Massage. <laughs> yes, let's get into the place and let's see how it goes. Yes, so this is the front desk. Chien Thai, where you make all your inquiries. They do all kinds of massage, including the cupping kind, which I really love. This is the waiting area. Yes, they have some pictures on the wall, like some paintings. I remember when I went to China and I used to not want to let people know where I was from. They would ask me if there are elephants in my country. If I said yes, it meant I was from Africa. Yeah, so this is how the place is like. <laughs> yeah, you have so many rooms down the hall, both on your left and on your right. Some rooms have two beds, others have three, um, depending on what you want. The price range is between a hundred cities and one fifty cities, I think. Yeah, so let's get into the rooms. This is like a couple room all on the left side um all arranged in this manner and then they have like an air condition a clock and that's all then they have the three sharing where there are three people having the massage maybe back massage foot massage any of them yeah and then those are the cups that they use for the cupping massage i don't know if you guys have ever tried it before Jung Tai um, and more. Jung Tai Massage is located almost everywhere worldwide, depending on where you are. So, this particular one is located in Tema Community 11 and it's called Jung Tai Guoji, Jung Tai International. Yeah, their towels were very clean. The place looked so neat, as you can see. They are open for work. Um, except for facials they said they don't do facials for now anymore um they'll resume doing facials next year so comment down below if you want to see me go for a cupping massage um and if you want to if you want me to share with you yeah the hassle is real you know so forgive me i'll have some breaks but please accept it like that um, I really enjoyed filming this for you guys. The people were so nice to me. So if you ever want to go and try, I'll leave their number <laughs> in the description and probably a website and a WeChat ID that you can contact them on. Also, <laughs> when I got there, I I saw something at the door that reminded me of what we used to say in China, like when Chinese people speak English, we call it Chinglish because of the way they pronounce the words. For example, they stress on the S when they want to say spoon, they could say spoon. If they want to say school, they could say suku. <laughs> yeah, so you guys, this is how the place looks like. Enjoy. So here are just a few more cups. Yeah. So they like put the fire in it then they put it on your back um like i said comment down below if you like to see a video on that on how it's done and yeah that's it i met this lady over there she's a worker there <laughs> this is the last room it has two beds um a different bed sheet i don't know why that this is kind of different but it's it's all cool so, yay! So this is all for John Tai and more. <laughs> and if you'd 
enjoy if you enjoyed this video don't forget to like it subscribe share if you haven't guys youtube tells me that most of the people who watch my video are not subscribed please subscribe okay it's free <laughs> yes and i'm definitely not going to finish this video without sharing their contact with you so always remember to please call in this number <laughs> yes chinglish call in this number 020569 whenever you want to have a massage thank you so much i hope you enjoyed it bye bye